What do we got? Oh. Reload that bad boy. There we go. something that bad get over here I'll whoop that ass oh one hit ow oh, I didn't dodge that quite in time nothing but chumps Can't beat this. Can't even touch this. Take that flare, though. Don't think so. Not this time. All right, we're heading back to the campgrounds. Should be pretty close. All oh, the chilling bears. Yeah, Barry, you be careful of those birds. I still had to reach Barry at the cabin, but at least I was out of the woods. I'd have to get the car from the locked garage. It would get me back to Barry faster, and the headlights were a welcome bonus. Oh, hello. The FBI agent's command froze me in place. I considered surrender. It was all falling apart anyway. I could give in, let someone else deal with it. But it felt all wrong. Cold instinct, his posture, the way he held the gun. He was no friend. Shots ringing in my ears, I leaped for the hole in the fence and stumbled into the darkness beyond. <sighs> All right. I remember what happens in here. A story is not a machine that does what you tell it. A story is a beast with a life of its own. You can create it, shape it, but as the story grows, it starts wanting things of its own. Change one thing and you set off a chain reaction of events that spreads through the whole thing. The characters have to be true to themselves. The events need to follow a logic that fits the story. A single flaw and the magic is gone. The story dies. Alice dies. I don't know why there's a TV in the bathroom, but uh... Yeah, I remember that. I specifically remember that. To the car. Here's the 
Here we go. Time to drive. Hey, dude. Uh oh. Out of the way. Good thing I didn't have to walk all this way. Oh, shit. Driving is pretty crazy. Focus the headlights. Get out of the way. Okay, I think we're getting there. Man, oh god. These controls. The controls themselves aren't bad, it's just the steering is a little sensitive. Alright, Barry, I'm coming. We're back in familiar territory. I got the other one. Nice. All right, Barry, I'm coming. It was the kidnapper. You son of a bitch! Where's my wife? Enough horseplay, Wake. You deliver the manuscript, and you can have your woman back. Simple as that. I don't. Listen, listen. I'm gonna need time to finish it. I still need to write the ending. I need a week. Not done. I need a week. Two days. The old Bright Falls coal mine is nearby. You can find it easy, city boy. The main building, there at noon. You bring the manuscript, you'll get your wife. If not, well, uh, get me. Yes, yes, I, I get you. All right. I'm coming, Barry. Barry had talked about birds over the phone. Oh, hello. Ow! Ow, I am so glad you're here. A couple of them got in here before I blocked the chimney. This isn't normal. These birds are weird. Alright, well, I'll go and get this. I'm trying, Barry. coming from all right come on birds
open the door now. They're gone. Ooh. I gotta go to the other side. Damn you, Barry. Hey, Al. I'm... I'm sorry for thinking you were having a psychotic episode, man. I sent Barry to the town to ask around about a man fitting the kidnapper's description. He'd go through the archives of the local paper. Perhaps he could learn something. Anything about the island and the cabin that had disappeared. The man wanted a manuscript. I had to try to write him one to get Alice back. For me, the supernatural had always been nothing but a metaphor for the human psyche, a tool to use in writing fiction. Now, it was happening for real, and I couldn't put a single word on paper. Barry Wheeler speaking. This is Rose. Rose? I found Mr. Wake's pages. Oh, you sweet, brilliant girl. Can you and Mr. Wake come get them? I live in the trailer park outside the town. We'll be there in less than an hour. Bye now. See you soon. Have a great day. Hope you come back soon. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the old dear diner. Good girl. my agent Barry. Damn it, Barry, the killer. You're my best friend, and I'm worried that you're not right in the head. The ransom is a manuscript I supposedly wrote that's coming true before my eyes. It happened just the way it was on that page. It's so dark. I have found only a few scattered pages. I want the entire manuscript. The deadline is in two days. I found Mr. Wake's pages. Good girl. How the hell did she get her hands on the manuscript anyway? I don't know. She's resourceful. I told you you were too hard on her. Listen, I found out all sorts of interesting stuff while I was digging around. Yeah. Mr. Wake, it's Sheriff Breaker. We have an FBI agent here, Agent Nightingale. FBI? He's anxious to see you. You'd better come to the station. Okay, I'll be right over, Sheriff. Let's make this quick, huh? Help you, folks. Alright, so this is where I'm going to go ahead and end it for this session. So thank you all for watching. I hope you all are enjoying Alan Wake for the PC. This is an awesome game. One of my favorite games of all time. I hope you guys are enjoying watching it. And I want to thank you all for the amazing love and support you've left on this series. And on the channel this year in 2014. It is very close to an end. I'm really looking forward to 2015. It's going to be an awesome year. Thank you all for the love and support. I love you all. And I will see you all next time. I am out.